Today we'd like to show you our most advanced trivia quiz sub engine that comes with support for accounts, multiplayer, leaderboard and advanced question system providing different question formats to choose from. Also this app comes with a support for both Android and iOS. Upon opening the app users will have to provide consent for either personalized or non-personalized ad experience. Here we can see all our ad providers with the ability to view how they handle user data. We also have a privacy policy section. Let's agree to personalized ad format. Here we can either sign up, log in or play as a guest. So let's choose a guest option for now. Guest players can enjoy the game as much as registered ones. The only difference is they won't be able to view the score on the leaderboard. As you can see, uh, we have our banner at the top. Now let's return to the main screen and log in with an actual account. We'll also opt for the sign in option, which allows us to automatically log in onto our account next time we open the app. Main screen contains username and previously obtained points that are assigned to the account on the game server. In the game settings panel we can modify the ad format as well as revoke the consent completely. On the leaderboard tab we can track our progress and see how we stack against other top players. Find me function will highlight our name and show us players with the closest score. We also have a frequently asked questions section. In the main screen users may also invite their friends which will grant them additional points. In the play section users may choose categories that can be for instance represented as difficulty levels. You may assign different reward points for each category. Let's select the first one and go to the list of available subcategories. Quiz mode allows for the creation of either image or text based questions. You may add as many questions as you like in the admin panel. Users have to select one correct answer from the four options available. The more time is left, the more points players will receive if the answer is correct. Let's just blitz through all of these questions. Once final question is answered, users will be presented with an interstitial ad and then they will be moved to the score view. Here users can see the total score, how much points they've obtained in a single run and they may also share their score. Now I'll show you how easy it is to reskin this app. Let's say we'd like to reskin this element and our background. We would need to prepare two images that are based on the provided assets in order to maintain best compatibility. When the assets are ready, all we have to do is just drag and drop them to the library and then select them and move them to the graphics folder. Now replace the existing assets. Since one of our elements differentiated from the original asset, We'll have to adjust it manually to suit our needs. And this is how you can rescan almost every asset in this project. It's that simple. In the admin panel, we may change our password under password. Under settings, we may customize the message that will be shared when 
one of your users invites one of the friends in the app content section we may add new categories here for instance if we click here we see the main category easy and then su subcategories it's very easy to edit one turn it off and on or delete it and here we might add also add new questions we may add to images as well for instance just here we select whether we want to have a, a text based question or image based question now title correct answer and three other misleading incorrect answers and then we have our uh, frequently asked questions here we may add new questions and answers just like that turn off and on then we have our privacy policy And finally, uh, all the app users, you may switch on off accounts, delete them or edit them. And this is the end of our presentation. Thank you for your time.